Hello everyone, it's Shannon with Shannon's Crafty DIYs. Welcome to my channel. So today I have a haul. I have a Dollarama, a Dollar Tree, and I'm gonna do one product review with you guys as well. I know it's been, it seems like it's been forever and a day since I've done a haul, and you do know that I post videos every Wednesdays and Saturdays at 8 p.m. Eastern. However, you know, because it is getting warmer, the summer is here, um, I just kinda, um, you know, I haven't been able to do a video two times a week uh, and you know we were just in Toronto a couple weeks ago for the baseball games as well so things kind of cost a little bit more money this time around so I've just been spending less at the Dollar Tree, Dollarama, uh, whatnot. But I am gonna do a couple more DIY videos coming up. I will have some more hauls. I actually do have a Dollar Tree shop with me. Not sure if I'm gonna do the haul first and then the shop with me, I'm not sure. Um, but I wanna get back up to doing my Wednesdays and Saturdays at 8 p.m. Eastern. Um, so yeah, that is just really why I've kind of slacked off a little bit from the Wednesdays and Saturdays, but most of the time I do post on my YouTube community, community page just to keep you guys um, up to date and um, informed when the next video is. So that being said, I have a Dollar, Dollarama, Dollar Tree, and I'm going to do one product review um, as well for you today. So let's jump in to the video um so you guys know you know i went to a cross border shopping with my mom um a little over a month ago and they had the goalie um supplements so i bought the greenies i bought the um relax and energy those are like more like chocolate bites the energy is the orange bottle and the uh, relax is the purple bottle this is I'm reviewing this one right now because it's finished. I ate the whole thing. I absolutely love these. They do taste fabulous. You get 60 um, chewable gummies per container. Um, this, it does say the daily dose is two twice a day. So four in total a day, which te technically only gives you 15 days worth of supplements. So I ended up just taking two in the morning and that was it. I really didn't follow the directions super well, but I figured I still got half the greens than what I would have if I, t if I had taken four chewables a day. So for the cost of what it was for $1.25, I know a lot of my YouTube friends have um, done their research to find out how much these cost. You can get these for like $19 or $16.99 at Walmart um, full price. The reason these were at the Dollar Tree now for $1.25 is because they are coming up to their expiry date. This one I think was it was good till um, November. Uh, no, actually this one is only good till June, which is now. Um, but what I want to say about these is that they are actually super good. They taste wonderful. I've had gummy type vitamins in the past. By the time you're halfway through your dose, you know, 15 days later, you're taking a little gummy and now it's like becoming, so the comparison, this reminds me of like a gummy bear, a nice soft gummy bear. By the end or mid to end of your package, you get more of like a really hard jube jube texture. This for the 30 days, because I only took tw uh, two um, gummies a day, so um, one month, the last bite was still just as good as the first day. And oh my gosh, so I have to say that is one positive thing about this. I actually love them. If I do another cross border shopping, I hope they still have these. I know now they've had the larger ones, but they also have the half size ones now too. I think there's only 30 chewables in there. But if I can still get my hands on some more of these, I absolutely will. Um, I have my other one on the go currently, so um, that'll give me probably till mid-July. But yeah, definitely go out and get these. Now, long little product review, but I definitely love them. Um, and I feel like you get a little healthier because you are getting some more green intake as well. So yeah, love that. Must go get them. Even the, the energy ones and the relaxed ones taste fabulous. It's almost like a little maybe like a caramel chocolate chew, but they're like little tiny bite size pieces. So the Goalie, perfect, perfect um, brand. I will definitely get my hands on some more of those. 
All right, so let's go into, we'll go into the Dollar Tree and then I'll show you the Dollar Rama after. So I found some new tissue paper. I know I just pulled some in a video or two ago, but these are super cute by Voila. One I was on the hunt for last year, never found them, but I finally found them this year, the lemons. You get eight pieces. You got four of the green and four of the lemons. I thought those were so stinking cute. But guys, check out the new patterns that I've seen this year. Look at this, the little like succulents. <gasps> How adorable. Like for somebody that's like very boho or into nature, that would be a, such a cute little wrapping paper or, you know, tissue paper for a present. And then this one, so cute. The watermelons, the oranges, you get the, um, the rainbows, and of course, the flamingos. Like, <laughs> how cute are those tissue paper? You could totally Mod Podge those to a wood surface as well. Definitely you can DIY with those. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I have an obsession with tissue paper. Why? I have to bring, I have to get more gifts for friends so I can wrap more gifts. <laughs> so I'm just gonna go randomly, not in any particular order, so I'm just gonna go to the next thing. Sorry guys, if you hear that little buzzing noise, my air conditioner just kind of popped right on during the video. So that is what you're hearing right now. So, oh my gosh, these come out enough at the Dollar Tree when they're like, um, getting close to the expiry date or whatnot, but this actually has a, a really excellent expiry date. The Pepperidge Farm Monaco Mint Chocolate Cookies. Guys, this expiry date is good till, um, oh yeah, so it is, it is coming up to the expiry date, but this is good till October 19th, 2023. So you guys, you know what, when I find them for $1.50, even at Target, their like regular price now is like three, or sale prices now is like $3.99. So for $1.50 here in Canada, I am definitely taking these for sure. So I bought not three, but four. <laughs> and I already opened this one. Um, I had to have a little snack on the way home from shopping. So yes, I picked up four of those. May give one to my mom, we'll see. <laughs> They are for me for sure. And you guys know I did say that it was slowing down on sugar. I do have, I still am, no sugar in my coffee, whatnot, no sugar after like 7, 7.30 latest at night. Um, I do have my two cookies a day, which sometimes like a pack of these, I think there's like three rows of like maybe five. So there's probably like 15 cookies in there. Like I could probably eat two rows of those in one day because I just, it's just a habit of just snacking, snack, snack, snack. So, you know, like the oven baked um, mint cookies that I love from the Dollar Tree. I, they come in two rows with like wrapped in, um, in foil. I could take one of those whole rows to uh, work and I would be almost done a roll in one day. So that's just to compare, just to tell you how much sugar I was in taking a day. For one or two cookies a day max, that is my dessert that I feel a lot better um, with. Yes. <laughs> um, anyway, so let's move on. I picked up these. I know they've been around, but I've never seen these personally, but the Clubhouse salad, salads and dips. Guacamole, guys. That is awesome. I've never seen guacamole, and especially at the Dollar Tree. Now, a dollar here in Canada, a dollar fifty. I'm not sure. Is there anything cheaper? Have you guys seen any grocery stores that sell them cheaper? Um, but I picked up two because this expiry date is amazing. This doesn't expire till September 17th, 2024. So you got a really excellent um, expiry date. And you know, they always say use the whole packet, but like honestly, actually, does it even say like the whole packet? Um, all you need is four ripe avocados, um, peeled and mash. All you do is combine mix. So yeah, you have to put like the whole mix, but if you just do one avocado or two avocados for making guacamole for nachos or whatnot, I probably put just like a tablespoon in the um, guacamole. You don't need the whole packet. Even for four avocados, you probably don't need the whole packet because I still put salt and pepper in there, do my own little thing. I feel like, I, I hope I'm not going into too many long stories with you guys and I hope that doesn't disappoint you as well. But when we went to Toronto, 
we went to this restaurant called Earl's. It's kind of like a Joey's. Uh, it's kind of like a Moxie's or like a Milestones uh, here in Canada. But they, we had an avocado guacamole dip and they put um, like, they put corn in it. They also put like feta in it and a little bit of like a spicy mayo as well. So, oh my gosh, like you don't need a whole bunch of this seasoning. And honestly with the feta and the corn, oh my gosh, like it was, I could have eaten just the whole bowl of the guacamole. Like that's how good it was. So hopefully this will add a nice little flavor to the guacamole as well. Picked up one of these, random, very random, but the cooking the cooking concepts, I just picked up a tra what's called a travel dressing container. So it's just one of these, um, what do you call them? Like a turkey baster. <laughs> so um, we had one in the past, but it was like the, the plastic, like the, um, the white plastic container. So you can never see if it was clean or not. Um, so now lately we, so I chucked it and now lately we just use like a spoon. So if we're like, um, uh, cooking some ground beef or something that has a lot of fat at the, um, that is building up in the pan, I like to use a spoon and just kind of take it out. But now this is a little bit easier just to go in the corners and take out the juice. So that's why I picked up that. Uh, yeah. So a couple more things from the Dollar Tree. Picks up another one of these, the gardening gloves. I just thought these were really pretty with the flowers. So I bought a couple of these from the Dollar Tree before, but now that I have like really long nails, I actually like punctured a hole through one of the fingers in the gloves when I was picking out dirt and stuff like that. So I'm like, now there's a couple holes in it. So I had to buy a new pair. So that's why I have these um, for $1.50 inexpensive. You know, if you're gonna put a hole through them, you might as well go a little bit cheaper and just get a, and get one of these. So because you guys know I am also not a gardener. My, uh, I, I wanna say I have a green thumb, but I really don't. <laughs> oh, I picked up this um, themed stickers, excuse, my, excuse me, six pack, but how fun are these? I've never seen these, but they're just like little galvanized metal heart stickers. So yeah, actually it shows you in the back some of the other ones. I'm pretty sure these are, I've seen like, I feel like I've seen this travel one um, at the Dollar Tree before, but that just shows you a couple other ones that they have as well. But I thought that would be really fun for Valentine's or any like any sort of farmhouse decor. A nice little galvanized metal heart. Yep, thanks. <laughs> um, and last from the Dollar Tree, just picked up this, the Color Vibe nail polish in like hot pink or fluorescent pink. It's a little bit brighter than my actual nails, but this is gonna be going on my toes. Their nail polish at the Dollar Tree is actually quite good. You always have to put two layers or two coats of um, nail polish on your toes, but that's like with any nail polish. So for that, for $1.50, thank you. I got a new set of, uh, I got a new thing of nail polish. <laughs> um, all right guys, last few things are gonna be from the Dollarama. Yes, I bought this because it's been forever and a day since I've seen double-sided tapes. So I picked one up for $1.25. I know it's not that exciting, but I love when I wrap gifts. I love putting it underneath rather than putting a piece of tape over the edge of the present. So that's why I picked up that. And these are also great for DIYs too. So you can also like, um, if you're putting pictures on a background, you can just put a piece of tape and it, um, it holds things in place that way as well. Makes it look cleaner looking. Picked up this, boring, but I just needed one. We don't go, we don't use these often at all. So I only picked up one for $1.50. You get 140 sheets um, and they're like the, the smart size it's called. So it's a mega roll, terrific towels, paper towel. Um, again, for $1.50, so it's like a mega roll. Um, and I like the fact that it has like those smart sheets so you can just pick one or pick a full sheet if you want it as well. That's it, don't need more than that. <laughs> Um, beautiful, beautiful napkins, guys. Um, these you get 18 per pack for a dollar fifty. It is the Friends, uh, Friends um, brand. I picked up some of these brands before. They have them at, like really special, um, fancy napkins at any holiday that you want. But I thought this was really beautiful with um the foliage. This is, is this the eucalyptus? I can't, no, it's not the eucalyptus, but I can't remember what this plant is, but 
They also came out with the matching um, paper plates as well. So you get 18 napkins, but the plates, I don't remember, and don't quote me on how much they were, but you only get 12 plates per um, pack. But yeah, aren't those gorgeous? They actually had the same napkins, same pattern, everything, but in blue. So just so you guys know. So oh, I just love napkins. You guys know I'm obsessed with napkins. Guys, the PS de Resistance, I think I'm saying that right, <laughs> from Dollarama. I don't know where these are coming from. They're probably coming from Michaels or they're coming from like Bed Bath & Beyond because they that I think Bed Bath & Beyond is now officially closed. Don't quote me on that yet, but I think I've heard news that it was closing. But for, this is only $4.50. I thought for sure this was gonna be like the max, like $5. Here we go. Oh my gosh. <laughs> How cute is that? Um, I have to say this has gotta be like six by like, I don't even know, like 20 maybe. Um, does it even tell you? The thing is it never tells you the size, but anyway, I think that is so cute. They had a B one. They actually had another uh, lemonade one as well. I think it says like, uh, yeah, I can't remember what the other one looked like. Maybe I, if I still have a picture, um, I'll show you guys. But yeah, I out of all of them, this was the best one um, that I loved. If we, you know, I feel um, this is just going to go in my kitchen so perfectly because I do love lemons for my kitchen. <laughs> so exciting. Yeah, if you guys, you guys got to go out and run and get these because they are so beautiful. And it does come with a jute hanger too. I'm not hanging it. I'm going to just probably just prop it up even above my cupboards in the kitchen, maybe over um, the sink. We'll see. So yeah. Oh my gosh, guys. So that is it. Oh yeah, you know what? So it says a Jew twine. Um, I should show you, yeah, you can hang it on the wall as well. It does have the hooks for hanging. So that is it, guys. That is it for my haul. I hope you guys enjoyed and are gonna run out and get these items yourself. If you don't see them in the stores yet, I know they are coming. Um, yeah, so run, don't walk. Lots of fun things um, to be had at the stores. That is it guys. So I hope you, you know, uh, join my YouTube world, subscribe to my channel, give me a big thumbs up. Um, that just allows YouTube to know that you are liking this sort of content um, and that you do like um, being a part of my YouTube world as well because I would greatly appreciate it. I love meeting new people. I love meeting all of you guys that are in all my oldies and my goodies. And yeah, that is it. So have a wonderful week, weekend, and we'll definitely see you guys in the next video. Bye!